Okay, Shalom. Okay, like the praise on and glory to Yahweh Bashem Yahushai. Brock of the Yahweh Bashem Yahushai. Brock of the Rakakadash. Okay, double honors to our apostles of Great Millstone, elders of GMS. And always peace and blessings to the hopeful fellow laborers, the children of Israel, people of Negro and Indian descent, Israelite foreigners as well. The elect that is looking to get delivered up out of this hell. Okay. What I have to present with you here today is um it's Esau wrecking hell, raising hell on this planet. Straight up hell on this planet. But um, it's actually Yahweh, the Heavenly Father, beginning to visit this world, which he made, which Second Ezra, is that six? It's like, let me read the scripture here. This is some amazing footage. This is absolutely amazing footage. And this is what's coming to a neighborhood near two thirds. And why I'm looking for this scripture? No, that's Second Ezra nine. Let me say this: that you know, this place has caused hell on defenseless nations for years and years. And American idiots, these sheeple, these um, these low-level, these devils, these devils, sat back and they applauded their government. They applauded their um, uh, their military, all, all service, all for, army, navy, air force, marines, sp space force. They applaud them for their destruction, their death, the theft that they've committed upon this world. They 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 applauded them. They lift them up. They made them. They labeled them heroes. You know, great men, great. Uh, they call them. Uh, what's the word? Um. Uh, um uh, uh great Americans they call them um uh the word is escaping which is probably a good thing that it does because it's a foul word in, in itself patriotic <laughs> you know they they make the word they turn them turn the word into a filthy word you understand the way they use it and they never expected these things to come back to visit them they never thought for one moment that one day, all this is we we done in the world is gonna come back and visit us. They never thought for a second. And this footage I'm gonna show you just to give you a glimpse of what the chaos that this evil Babylonian empire has caused around the world. But let me read the scripture here. Um, second Ezra the ninth chapter. Um, speaking of the sign, then shalt thou understand that it is the very same time wherein the highest will begin to visit the world which he made. Therefore, when there shall be seen earthquakes and uproars of the people in the world. And listen, the uproars of the people don't just apply it to those that are, apply to those that are um, marching and picketing and rioting. Uh, you can apply that also with these world militaries as well. With using, um, let me see if I can find it here. It might be under Drudge. It might be in Drudge with North Korea. With North Korea. Let me find it. Let me see if I can find it. Here we go. North Korea says recent tests were tactical nuclear drills overseen by Kim. You can apply this to the militaries as well. You know, these massive militaries around the world that have over a million men and women ready to fight. And these loyal military men and women to these countries, they, man, they're in a, they're at an uproar. They're at an uproar, you know, having missiles, uh, laser guided missiles, smart bombs. These people are ready to fight, man. These people are ready to fight, you know. So it says uproars are the people in the world. And when I say, why I say you can use that 
as well as when you go to Isaiah the fourth, Isaiah 13th and four, the words that I'm looking tumultuous, tumultuous noise of the kingdoms of nations here. Like as you see, the noise of a multitude in the mountains. Those the those that mount, mountains represent governments. Okay, like as a uh, like as of a great people, a tumultuous noise of the kingdoms of nations gathered together. The Lord of hosts mustereth the host of the battle. Okay, let me get back to that again. Nor there was a North Korea. You know they tell you through their media that the North Korean is forcing their people at gunpoint to serve them and to you know. No, you're a fool. You believe that madness, you know, you're a fool. And this just isn't all. There's more. Um, let me think of uh, uh, nations all around the world. Again, he's mustering the host, dealing with as well OPEC as well. OPEC plus. It's a plus sign. These people are getting ready, man. You know, and a lot of times before a lot of wars are fought, it starts with um, uh, affecting opposing nations, um, money and uh, natural resources, things like that. So this war is already headed. It's already in, 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 to, in play here. All right. And these OPEC nations. Um. Here they are. That's the list of them right there. All right, so. Upwards of people in the world, then shalt thou well understand that the Most High spake of those things from the days that were before thee, even from the beginning. For like as all that is made in the world hath a beginning and an end, and the end is manifested. This is what we're witnessing. The end manifesting itself. And with the end manifesting itself, it's going to come in the form of death and destruction. Watch this video here. You can see a, a girl was recording a me video message in Kev and was hit by an explosive wave. Check it out. This is, this is, a, this is amazing footage. I gotta play it again. And don't forget that Ukraine is attacking his own citizens as well. Don't forget that. Don't believe the fools. But Ukraine is attacking its own infrastructure and blaming it on, on uh, Russia so they can uh, cry war crimes and things like that. You know, but it doesn't matter. Um, you know, eventually, that whole uh, Ukrainian government is going to get destroyed, and, and uh, Russia is going to take con total control of that, of that, uh, of that land. You know, but this is the first video I've seen waking up this morning on another site. First video I've seen after waking up and turning on the TV, this one here. I don't want to hear that damn music. That shit vexes the hell out of me, this modern day trash. These are uh, civilian infrastructures that are being hit. America's in trouble, man. You know, y'all bless me, y'all. I got the got the worst plan for this place here. Has the worst place. He has the worst plan for this place. Okay, there's more. Here's that sellout right here. 
I ain't gonna play his madness though. Here we go. Sebastian Cerullo, I'm in Kiev, Ukraine, October 10th. Russian terrorism at its worst. A Ukrainian civilian dead in the center of the street as the first responders working rapidly to put out the rest of the footage. i delete this video of me showing that footage. Just show someone laying there. <laughs> Too much scripture here. Okay. So we ain't going into that word tumultuous. Tumultuous. Okay, the word there is show on. Roar. Roar. Din, crash, uproar. Roar of water, uproars, uh, revelers, revelers. Um, I thought I had it somewhere. Let me do it this way instead. That's my word, that tumultuous. Okay, here we go. Oxford language, Oxford dictionary here. I love Oxford. Making a loud, confused noise, uproar, uproarious. Glorious. I'm going to the other word as well. Mustereth. I already have that up. Mustereth. Okay, here we go. Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai mustereth them hosts to the battles. He's preparing these militaries. And North Korea has been shooting off uh, ballistic missiles on a daily practice. A symbol of troops, especially for inspection or in preparation for battle. It's about to go down. Okay. They come from a far country from the end of heaven, even the Lord and the weapons of indignation to destroy the whole land. So there's going to be um, America's going to get um, um, invaded. Oh, America's we have um, 600 million guns, whatever the hell they say. <laughs> People are funny as hell. It's almost comedy listening to them. Oh, many guns are in uh, America. <laughs> over 393 million, over 98% of those guns are in civilian hands. The equivalent of 120 firearms per 100 citizens. And, and, and and they thinking that oh all this is in the civilians' hands oh they they gonna come together I mean come on they can't even come together and um and stop the government remember let's not forget the June sixth <laughs> when they invaded Washington D C and half of them are in, in 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 jail right now or or uh or or or, or facing jail time you know uh, with uh pending court battles <laughs> people are jokes man. You know, the only thing they're looking forward to, they can look forward to is throwing their camouflage and go, and go hide in the woods somewhere, you know. But as far as Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai is concerned, what he's planning on doing in this place, what he's planning on doing in this place as far as bringing in that family, like, like again, we always tell you that this family is coming, you know. He's going to starve them out. These people don't even, not even thinking about uh, the Lord at all and what his, and, and, and any of his plans. He's going to throw a wrench in all their damn plans, man. You know? <laughs> he's going to starve these people out to the point that he's going to have these wicked Egyptians. This was the refer we'd like to refer to him as well, another name. We gave these Babylonians, these wicked, uh, proud Americans, you know, with, because this place is spiritual Egypt. It's Sodom and Egypt. We call, the scriptures call them Egyptians as well. You know, the Egyptians. Here we go. Um... Let me see if I can find the scripture here. It's in the book of uh, Isaiah. I know that. Let 
Is it Egyptians? But we will find out. It might be Egyptians of Egyptians. It cracks me up. They're so proud and they just talk so violently like <laughs> Isaiah 19 and 2 and I will set the Egyptians against the Egyptians and they shall fight everyone against his brother and everyone against his neighbor city against city and kingdom against kingdom that's a beautiful scripture that's a beautiful scriptures if and, and if that's not comforting to you then well, I'm sorry I, I don't know what's going to comfort comfort you knowing that these proud this proud trash that's a lot of them are, uh, uh, planning on uh, killing a whole lot of so-called black folks. They're looking for this opportunity. You got even some of these dumbass niggas that are actually planning on doing a whole lot of unrighteous acts, unlawful and uh, and wicked acts in, in these last days, man. They all Egyptians. He's going to turn them all against each other, you know. So it's like I forgot where I was at here. Here we go. So it says here, um, how ye for the day of the Lord is at hand. It shall come as a destruction from the Almighty. Therefore shall all hands be faint and every man's hearts shall melt and they shall be afraid. Pangs and sorrows shall take hold of them. They shall be in pain as a woman that travaileth. They shall be amazed one at another. Their faces shall be as flames. <laughs> they're no, they're in confusion and madness. And, 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 you know, the main thing is uh, we never thought this, they, we, this, we never, they, they've done it. They destroyed our beautiful country, our God fearing country. They never imagined this could happen to this place. They never imagined this happening to this place. So they allowed the wickedness to continue on. They allowed to participate and continue on, uh, uh, fueling this wicked, this wicked place, man. You know, as the scripture says, the people have used oppression in let me see if i can find that word let me see if i can find it mm. here we go ezekiel 22 is only one that come up 22 and 29 the people of the land have used oppression and exercised robbery and have vexed the poor and needy. Yea, they have oppressed the stranger wrongfully. I mean, what scripture describes this place any better than that? You know, and they allowed it to go on uh, when, uh, again, the elected officials, these these uh, uh, people that come under the, the banner of, the flag of law and biting citizens, law enforcing officers. They allowed this madness to continue on. But it's all, you know, it's it's all by the hands of Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shai, using this devil to do what he's doing. But this place has to pay for its wickedness. They went over and above with their wickedness, you know, in oppressing the uh, the, the apple of Yahweh Bashim, Yahweh Shai's eye. You know? They went over and above. They went, uh, they went, they they went uh, they got out of hand. They lost their damn they lost their damn their, their damn minds. <laughs> and I sought for a man among them that should make up the hedge and stand in the gap before me for the for the land that I should not destroy, but I found none. Therefore have I poured out my indignation upon them. I have consumed them with the fire of my wrath. Their own way have I recompensed upon their heads, said the Lord Power. Ooh, that's beautiful. Check it out. Therefore have I poured out my indignation upon them. I have consumed them with the fire of my wrath. Their own way, their own way have I recompensed upon their heads, 
said the Lord Power. Is this not a perfect example? And I know this ain't, it could be just Jake's over there. Let's not forget that there's Jake's over there. It's a bad video, man. You know, so much for the speak volumes if, you, if your eyes are open and seeing what I'm talking about. People every day monitor their damn businesses wanting to live a peaceful life. But have to worry about bombs flying over your damn head. Russia is just trying to protect his, uh, to protect his, his borders, protect his, his country, man. <laughs> you know, Babylon is taking, the, the, the Romans are taking the battle to them, provoking the world. The Babylon uh, has provoked and, uh, and, 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 and brought uh, nothing but uh, fear into this world, man. <laughs> That's an amazing video, though. It is an amazing video, you know, seeing Edomites in fear, you know, seeing, oh, here we go. Um, Psalms 137 and 17. Remember, O Yahweh, the children of Edom in the day of Jerusalem, who said, raise it, raise it, even to the foundations thereof. O daughter of Babylon, who ought, who ought to be destroyed, happy shall he be that rewardeth thee. And thou hast served us. Happy shall he be that taketh and dasheth thy little ones against the stones. Ooh. <laughs> it says this. Behold, the day of the Lord cometh cruel, both with wrath and fierce anger, to lay the land desolate, and he shall destroy the sinners thereof out of it. For the stars of heaven and his constellations thereof shall not give their light, the sun shall be darkened in his going forth, and the moon shall not cause her light to shine. And I will punish the world for their evil, and the wicked for their iniquity. And I will cause the arrogancy of the proud to cease, and I will lay low the haughtiness of the terrible. I will make a man more precious than fine gold, even a man than a golden wedge of Ophel. You know, because in this time, um, the, a man of the Lord. It's the, he, when I, I will make a man. That's not just any man. Those these that man is a man of the Lord. That man is an elect man. He's an elect man. He's a special man. He's a holy man. You know. He's a righteous man. He's a fellow laborer. You know. He's a fellow laborer. He's a that man that has faith. You know. That's a man with faith. You know. Not just a nigger. Not just some redneck. Uh, 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 skinhead or some redneck devil, you know. And I'm those redneck devils I'm referring to are Israelite foreigners, because coming out of those some of those group nations that look like Edomites, there's brothers amongst them, there's sisters amongst them, and they act just like brothers. They act just like sisters, you know. So that man is going to be precious than fine gold, you know, that man, because that's where the man, yeah, where that, Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai is going to have a hedge around that man, protecting that man, you know, it says, therefore, I will shake the heavens and the earth shall be removed out of her place in the wrath of the Lord of hosts and in the day of his fierce anger. And it shall be as the chase roll and as a sheep that no man taketh up. They shall every man turn to his own people and flee every one into his own land. Everyone that is found shall be thrust through a, 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 um, a invasion. Everyone that is found shall be thrust through and every one that is joined unto them. Uh, hand, hand joined in hand. You got niggas with... <laughs> just the white man can do no wrong. You got these niggas that served in the military and they just got put got full trust in Esau's uh government. You know? They got all they got full trust in Esau and his uh his wicked ways. What does the scripture say in Isaiah? Um let me see if it's 32. Give me a second here. Let me find it. I'm not sure it's just 30, 31. 
32. Oh, here, yeah, 31. Let me pull it up here. Isaiah 31 and 1. Woe to them that go down to Egypt for help and stay on horses and trust in chariots because they are many and in horsemen because they are very strong. But they look not unto the Holy One of Israel, neither seek the Lord. They, they're seeking Esau. They're seeking Esau. They're looking for their masters, you know, because that, 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 that spell of uh, captured bonding is heavy. It's heavy upon them. So they're looking for Esau for help. They're looking to join hands with Esau and help Esau, hoping that after all the smoke settles, that they, Esau will give them favors. People are fools, man. Fools. Fools. It says, yet he also is, yet he also is wise and will bring evil and will not call back his word, but will rise against the house of the evildoers and against the help of them that work iniquity. Now the Egyptians are men. And not God, and their horses flesh, and not spirit. When the Lord shall stretch out his hand, both he that helpeth shall fall, and he that is holding shall fall down, and they all shall fall together. Back to Isaiah the thirteenth chapter. Every one that is found shall be thrust thrust through. And every one that is joined unto them shall fall by the sword. You're gonna have soldiers with bayonets on top of their on 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 the tip of their uh swords. These niggas gonna get, get poked in the ass. <laughs> their children also shall be dashed to pieces. Again, that was that Isaiah, the book the Psalms. The book of Psalms that I've read. Their children also shall be dashed to pieces before their eyes. Their houses shall be spoiled and their wives ravished. <laughs> oh, this is beautiful. Babylon will fall. <gasps> Babylon will fall to the Medes. You know. Babylon will fall to the Medes. So I'm gonna leave it at that. All right. All praise on and glory to Yahweh. Bless you, Yahweh. Shy. Till next time, we're willing. Shalom.